A Philadelphia family wants the answer to one simple question. Why? Why a 27 year old man with no criminal record, a college graduate and who hadn't lived in Philadelphia for eight years, was shot and killed while visiting family last October. Our Sergio Cruel reports. Why did y'all pick him to kill? It's not right. I know people say like their kids was good kids, but he was really a good kid. I'm in South Philly on the 1800 block of Corley Street where unfortunately 27 year old Jawan Mason lost his life. He was scheduled to have his braces removed on October 6th and he had his flight booked for that afternoon. He wound up being murdered on October 5th. Jawan Mason was a former high school basketball star and a Bloomsburg University graduate with a bachelor's degree in criminal justice. Jawan moved out of Philadelphia when he went to college in 2012 and never looked back. He recently moved to Miami, Florida in August of 2020 to start the next phase of his life. Jawan came back to Philadelphia to spend time with his family a week before his October 6th orthodontist appointment. Jawan was standing outside of his grandmother's home talking on the phone when his family says he was shot to death. He noticed a car that looked as suspicious to him. Then it rolled past again, rolled around the front, came through the gate and snuck up on my son and killed him. He wasn't involved in the streets. It's sad that he had to go that way. He tried not to be a statistic and he became one anyway. Jawan's death is a part of the 499 homicides in 2020, adding to the ever-growing problem in this city. According to his family, he had no criminal record, just a guy with big dreams and plans. Being the youngest of four, his family says all he wanted to do was make them proud. He wanted to be an entrepreneur just to do different things in life. Without him, I don't know where I'd be. These people got to stop going around just shooting innocent people. Now, the Philadelphia police is still investigating Jawan's case. As of right now, no suspects have been arrested. But of course, if you have any information that can help this family, please contact 911. I'm Sergio Cruel, Fox 29 News.